What's up guys, this video is brought to you by Textify, an iOS and Android app that turns voice messages you receive into a text format. So Textify works with WhatsApp, iMessage, Therma and Line Messenger. So if you're ever in a situation where you cannot listen to a long voice note, just Textify it and you'll be good to go. What's up guys, Chevron coming at you with a brand new video and recently WWDC has just passed 3-4 hours ago and iOS has released a bunch of new software updates. One of these software updates was iOS 11. So a lot of people be thinking that oh I can't get iOS 11 until fall. Well if you're watching this video you could get this without a developer account for absolutely free. So I'm going to show you guys is just how to do that. So as you can see right here my phone is on iOS 10.3 I think 10.3.2. So what you need to do is just open the link down below in the description below the subscribe button and then you want to just open it in Safari meaning that if you're using the YouTube application you just need to hit the circular Safari icon in the bottom right hand corner it will bring you to this page then you just see the download iOS 11 in brackets you want to hit that one you'll open this profile hit install and then what you want to do guys if you have a passcode enter your passcode then you need to hit install again in the top right hand corner hit install you need to restart your device so if you have 80% or higher for example you have 90% you don't need to plug in your phone but if you have below 90% you'll need to charge your phone because it will not continue so yes guys once your device has been fully restarted you won't be on iOS 11 as yet you just need one more step and what you need to do is just enter all your passcode information if you have one once you enter your passcode information you just need to go into settings then go to software update if it's not working just jump out of software update go back in there jump out of software update go back in because a lot of people are, are murdering the server right now so that's why you might not see it so just give it some time jump back out go back in it took me three tries i think to get this right so as i said guys just jump back out jump back in then you'll need to hit just download and install right there enter your passcode once more because iPhone is super serious with the security. So once you just enter your password, as you can see, it says update required, and it was supposed to give you this little tiny white bar with a blue progress bar, and that will tell you the remaining time, how, how long it will take in order to install this profile. 12 seconds later. So yes, guys, once the profile has been finished, you'll be greeted with this beautiful like this new feel it's like i can just feel the icons moving there's this new files icon as well and then of course i had to try out the control center which was pretty cool the files icon is basically ifile in my opinion and it just hosts a bunch of files a lot of applications in Cydia and also the app store normally do does what the new files app does so it's not really something that is mind-blowing or game-changing in my opinion but as you can see they have a lot of like animation changes the the app store app changed as you can see it has a different color then the calculator app was changed as well redesigned circular icons and all of that caught me by surprise i really like how it looks in my opinion i tried the 3d touch but nothing worked there and then of course if you pull down you could see a different effect from the notification center and swipe up you have all of the control center changes 3d touch on them all of that to me looks ugly but hopefully it grows onto me hopefully we can do something with this because it just looks like an unfinished product in my opinion but yes guys if you like this video definitely drop a like down below and always love peace and tweaks signing out